Well, by now you've probably heard about the push to rename Jefferson Square Park. The site has been home to protests for three weeks now, and today Chris 2X with Game Changers, Tatiana Wells, and Brianna Taylor's mom spoke out about what they'd like to see happen in that circle. These riders came from near and far. Uh, all the riders that came down with us are from Kentucky, Tennessee, Ohio, North Carolina, and Georgia. With Tamika Palmer huddled on the back of one of the nearly 300 hogs leading the way for what she'd still like to see done at this very spot, where hundreds have left their mark saying her daughter's name. It's a beautiful thing. It's still a lot of work to be done. Joined by Chris 2X with Game Changers and Tatiana Wells, the male and female duo spearheading the renaming efforts at Jefferson Square Park. The two want to see this spot renamed the Breonna Taylor Fountain Circle. We want to do something as a permanent marker for Breonna where she can act as that presence for him. We want to make sure that we do have that representation, that we honor who she was. She was somebody who saved lives. She was an everyday hero. Chris 2X highlighting Brianna was a first responder who in her career worked with gunshot victims and survivors. Those survivors who are losing individuals and are, are fatally wounded to reckless gunplay in the city, Brianna's presence will also be a connection with them too. In a sea of loud engines, they garnered the support of bikers. Vincent Harris, a.k.a. Big Dog, is the leader of this group. When we start looking back at the things that happened uh, with Brianna and what happened here in Louisville, and from the MC community, it's always something that's always negative. So we want to bring something positive. Sharing in Tamika's grief as she explains all those steps have been taken for justice in Brianna's case. It's a start. It's a start. This name change and the recent developments, like the firing of one of the officers involved in her daughter's death, have not hit the mark. I won't say relief. I mean, it was a long time coming, but it's just the beginning. Like I said, that I mean, that doesn't put a dent in what's, what happened. Well, Tamika says she's grateful for all the support that she's received so far. The biker group today also presenting her with $1,800 that they all collected, all from donations, all going to the family for this cause.